Hey guys, this is CES. I just wanted to do a quick unboxing of my new black capto Oxfords from Herring. This is the Mayfair model. It's one of their best sellers. Um, I just received them. Actually, they were in DHL uh, like for a month. Uh, so I'm very excited for this. I ordered uh, them on um, June 3rd. And now, um, as you know, we're well into July, so I'm very happy. So the first thing we find, this is the, the return label and the instructions for that. Um, this is the Safir Renova Tour. I ordered this to hydrate the shoes. Remember, it's very important to hydrate the shoes um, because you, you don't know how many months it's been since the shoes uh, have been in the box or in any um, warehouse. This is also um, a shoe cream, a black shoe cream that Herring provided for me. And um, now, what else? This is uh, a shoehorn from Herring. Uh, it's plastic, it's a very good size. And uh, as you can see, both shoes come in separate um, dust bags. Very good cloth. And... Um, it's kind of hard for me to do this with one hand, but this is the shoe. As you can see, a very classic Capto Oxford. It's really nice. Um, at this um, price level is um, $243. Um, I think this is as good as it gets. Um, Herring, this one is made by Barker, the famous English brand. They have been doing um, shoes since the 1800s. Um, this is uh, the quality control person and um, comes stuff with um, tissue paper. It's um, leather soles, leather linings. Actually, it's a uh, three-quarter leather lining and full leather uppers. Uh, it has, um, I'm not sure if you're able to see. Yeah, it's a um, double stitch and the cap toe and then a single stitch here at the vamp. This quarters come also with a double stitch, very high quality. I measured the, the stitch density and it's uh, six stitches per inch. So not the highest, but it's, it's good. I mean, it's a good year well to chew. Um, from the back, you can see the heel uh, sits tight not too tight like a bespoke shoe but this is not a bespoke shoe of course so it's pretty good um comes with this mixed heel with a little bit of rubber for durability and uh, of course the herring logo with latin thank you god and this is the herring shoes made in england stamp um it's not invisible stitching but um still I, I think this is a well done sole. Um, I will let you know guys in the comment section if it's true size or how they fit. I am uh, 10 and a half US and um, Herring customer service recommended for me to go in a nine and a half. So again, this is the Mayfair nine and a half um, made in England. And um, hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any other questions.